Hey, Safari Sam here, and you're just in time for some letter writing. Do you want your letters to look nice? I use animal letters to make my letters look nice. If you missed out on what an animal letter is, check out the Learn to Write with Safari Sam video. I'll leave a link in the description below. Now, if you want to practice writing your letters with me, download our free letter writing template found on our link tree. Let's begin by talking about where you should not start writing your letters. A letter can start almost anywhere, except for one place. When I write letters, if I want them to look really, really nice, I never start at the bottom. Today, we're going to learn how to write the letter Q. Ah, another monkey letter. I'm so excited about these. Do you remember what animal letter the lowercase Q is? That's right. It's a monkey letter. I love doing monkey letters. I think monkey letters are probably my favorite. I'm showing you how to write both uppercase and lowercase letters. When we do our letters, we do it two times. The first time is with dotted lines, and the second time is doing it all by ourselves. Do you have your writing paper that you downloaded off for Linktree? If you did, then you're ready to start. If you didn't, you can pause the video and go download the template so that you can practice with us. All right, here we go. Let's start doing the letter Q. First, of course, is the uppercase Q. When I do the uppercase Q, I start at the top. So I want you to put your pencil at the top where I am. Are you there? Okay, here we go. And all we do is we're gonna go all the way around. It's kind of like the O, isn't it? It looks like the O. So if you practice O, then you have the Q almost down. Just one more thing is needed. We'll show you in a minute. When I get to the top, I pick up my pen, and you see this little line down there? We have to have that, so I'm gonna put my pen right there and go down. And there is the uppercase Q. Now the lowercase Q is going to start in the middle. If I was to start at the bottom, do we start letters at the bottom? No way. If we start the letter at the bottom, it's gonna just look like it's at the top. Watch, I'll do it. I'll go like this. That's how some, some people would do it. And that's up there, it looks like an uppercase letter. We can't have that, no way. We have to make sure we write each letter in the place that it needs to start so it looks really nice. So let's get rid of this Q. No way, we don't want that one, do we? Okay, so do we start at the bottom? No, never from the bottom. So with the lowercase Q, I'm gonna start right here. So put your pencil in the same place. Are you ready? Here we go. Go all the way around. And then we stop right there. And then I come back to the top and I go down and remember, what do I get to do with uh, monkey letters? That's right, I get to go below the line. And then we just go right back up just like that. And there is the lowercase q. All right, it's time to do it by ourselves without the dotted line, so let me erase this. Aren't you glad that you don't have to do this? I bet you are. Are you having fun practicing the letter q? I sure am. Okay, now we can do the letter q all by ourselves. Remember, where do I start? Well, for the uppercase Q, the uppercase Q starts at the top. Do you have your pencil at the top? Okay, here we go. We go around, just like we're making the letter O. And then I stop when I get to the top. That looks just like the letter O. And then what makes it different is I come right here and I make a diagonal line down to the bottom and there is our uppercase Q. Are you ready for the lowercase Q? Do I start at the bottom? No, that's right, good. We don't start at the bottom ever. I start in the middle and I go all the way around. This is where I'm doing that all important C letter first. 
A lot of letters are starting like that. It looks like C, doesn't it? And then I come back up to finish it and I go down and remember, what do we get to do? Because it's a monkey letter. Go below the line and put my little hook on there. There we go. There's the letter Q, both uppercase and lowercase. I bet your Qs are awesome. I'm so glad that you came by to do the letter Q. I hope you had a lot of fun because I sure did. I hope you'll come back and, and do another letter with me because I have so much fun writing letters. We'll see you next time. Bye. Mm -hmm.